Well, we are working to learn more information about a deadly crash that closed part of I-35 in Hayes County for several hours this morning, but we should mention it has reopened. That's right. It happened just south of Posey Road. Brittany Glass has been on the scene. She joins us there now with kind of what we know. Brittany, good morning. Well, good morning. Now all lanes of traffic I-35 southbound have only been back open for an hour, about 50 minutes or so. What we do know, new information, DPS confirming to us that the victim in this crash was the semi driver, a 58 year old man from Fort Worth. Now all lanes of traffic on I-35 South were closed for more than six hours this morning after the semi rolled over into the shoulder shortly after one o'clock near exit 196. Officials with the Texas Department of Public Safety are investigating the crash out of San Antonio. We are still waiting for more information about their investigation and to what may have caused it, but we do know that the semi was the only vehicle involved. Officials with TxDOT tell me the semi's diesel tank ruptured, which explains why hazmat crews were here for so long this morning cleaning up the scene. I'm told the semi was carrying motor blocks. The semi's truck was removed shortly after the crash happened early this morning, but as you can see behind me, the trailer still remains here on the shoulder. I'm told that it's expected to be picked up sometime later today. Reporting live in San Marcos, Amanda.